But this is like my childhood here, basically. Naturally. Welcome back, I'm Miss Lauren Lee 11 and today I'm going to be showing you something that actually introduced me to the pink hair moisturizer hair lotion potion. When I was formally introduced to the pink, it was actually with another product, but this product aided in the styling of the hair and obviously I don't know why I'm going on that, you don't know what it is, it's still in the title, but it is, and this isn't any old hair dryer guys, this is the Power Pick. This is the one that I used to have back in the day and we didn't actually have these two attachments. We had this alone with it, okay? I bought it for nostalgia because, you know, I'm going for a bit of nostalgia at the moment. I don't think it's momentarily. I just think it's, it's just going back. It's just going back, that's all, that's all. Don't go back on everything, guys, but just go back on the good stuff, okay? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna section my hair. My hair is washed and conditioned. Uh, apply the pink moisturizer and use that as my leave-in and styler I guess and then I'm just gonna uh blow dry it we're talking about the hair dryer I believe I paid nine no I believe I paid <laughs> I paid 19 pounds for it well 19 I paid 20 pounds for it 19.99 which I thought it would be a lot more expensive considering that I suppose I thought it was a well sought after product but maybe not I don't know so this is my hair with no product it is actually quite soaking wet but to be honest, that's fine because I'm going to blow dry. I'm not going to let it air dry, as you know. So yes, I got the full 32 fluid ounce. So this is how much I'm using for that section. Can you see that, guys? That is a lot. Maybe I don't need all that much. No, that's too much. I'm going to use one hand for that section because I don't know what I was thinking. I've got a towel to hand, so if this is triggering you, I'm sorry. I'm just going to use this for the ends for now. I'm really excited to try this hair dryer. Well, I know why, guys. It's just childhood memories, isn't it? Before I show you the comb part, which is the exciting part for me, it comes with these two attachments. So these are concentrating nozzles. I believe this one, if I'm correct, I don't know, but I don't really care because these are not the ones I'm going to be using. But <laughs> I believe this is one for when you know, like when you're blowing out your hair and you're doing that with a big paddle brush. And then this one is just, I suppose, concentrating on certain areas, but they're both concentration nozzles. That's what I meant. I think they're pretty self-explanatory. This is the one I am looking forward to. And plus guys, it has improved. And what I mean by that, if you remember these combs guys, well the one I had never had this rubbery bit on here and it just gives it more hold. So it's inside, it's got these little ridges and it's attached. If you can see me pushing that. And it just gives it more support for the actual hair dryer because I suppose you're doing, I don't want to say tugging because that just doesn't sound appealing, does it? <laughs> it just helps with the combing process. Okay, let me begin. So let me just show you here, guys. So it's got three heat settings. So it's got cool, medium, hot, and then you've got zero, which means off. And you've got the low fan and the high fan or speed. I'm going to have to stop talking at this point, guys, because you know, it's going to be loud. But I think I'm going to go on medium setting, high speed. I am a woman, not here to please you. It's time to move on, cause my time is now. I am a woman, play by my own rules. I got my duvet on. I just have to stop and show you this for a second, guys. This is a cute little style anyway. I mean, is this how they create afros? I just can't get afro for the life of me. Anyway, come on, let's get back to it. <laughs>
Okay, so this is what I've got so far. As you can see, I still got some curl formation in there, which is fine. I love my curls. Don't get it twisted, guys. Have a look from the back. Okay, so obviously you saw me apply the pink in this section. My hair feels so soft, guys. You can see it's nice and lightweight does not feel dry at all. For those of you who want to know if it feels moisturized, yes it does. My hair is dried, as in the sense I've now dried the water out of my hair, but my hair feels soft and moisturized. <sighs> so now I've used the heat setting. I don't want to put so much heat on my hair. So I'm going to switch it down to the cool setting, but still on a high speed. <laughs> Just to finish it off and set my hair, I guess. Guys, I do want to say this though, I think from now on I possibly may be doing less and less wash and goes only because I can't find a gel that I'm happy to continue using and I don't want to name names but you know. So I'm just warning you guys, I'm not warning, I'm just letting you guys know, I'm just being real, I'm just letting you guys know that if I do end up doing wash and goes, they will be predominantly either the pink by itself or with the what's it called uh it's the blue magic hair grease i mean if you can recommend some gels to me that um aren't cancelled especially if you are in the uk and you know where to get them over here guys i mean i've been using one particular gel for the longest and uh i no longer wish to use it so <laughs> right so let me get on with the rest of this guys i got my duvet on solid ground
guys look at the shine if you can see guys this bit looks a lot straighter because the front of my hair for some reason the curls are i believe they're about 3b the rest of my hair is like 3c to 4a which i would have preferred for my curls to be at the front but obviously i can't choose my texture now since using these products so the pink the hair grease the s curls products the luster products i've been using them for what nearly two months now the thickness of my hair, guys, as you can see, my strands are fine, as I always say, but the thickness of my hair has come back. This is what my hair was like when I was a child. I told you, my hair loves mirror wall. It is actually thicker. This is like my childhood hair, basically. Yeah, my daughter's hair, and she's got 4B hair. She's got a mixture of 4A and 4B hair. Again, I've used pink lotion on her hair, and this is the only cream type product that her hair loves any other type of cream products it dries her hair it shrinks it up to her scalp and then it gets tangled this stretches out her hair keeps it moisturized i can do her hair in twist and it will stay stretched and it's nothing wrong with having shrinkage guys but i'm talking about shrinkage that shrinks up to the point where your hair almost mats together and then um uh, tangles the hair grease works well on her hair for my son's hair i've been using the s curl activator gel a s curl gel activator s curl S curl activator gel the one that i always use <laughs> and his hair loves it it just soaks it up if i do put like hair grease or pink in his in his hair it tends to look a bit dry even though it's soft to touch it looks dry but the s curl moisturizer his hair just soaks it all in and it stays juicy yeah so let me just go ahead and do the other side and then i will get back to you This is my hair blown out with the pink moisturizer, guys. Yes. Anyway, <laughs> right, so I'm gonna go and uh, apply hair grease to my scalp just because I've washed my hair with a clarifying shampoo and I don't want my scalp to then be dry when my hair's all nicely moisturized. So the hair grease I'm using is the Dax Lanolin, 100% pure lanolin. And it says super hair conditioner. And I love this one because it's got a mild fragrance. As with this scalp, it's like, when I come out the shower, I like to moisturize my skin. You see, your scalp is skin and it needs to be moisturized once your hair's washed, right? That's my logic. I mean, if that doesn't make sense to some, then I don't know what to say, but that's my logic. And it's what works for me. So I'm moisturizing my scalp. Okay. Oh, that's nice. That, oh, that, that felt so good. Right, do you know what? this is the end of the video I, I hope you enjoyed it guys and i hope you know it brought back childhood memories and all that jazz thank you so much for watching i will we'll see you in the next one guys don't forget to like and subscribe bye